Hello, my name is Dominic Avogado, and I'm a recruitment officer here with U of T Engineering. Today, we're going to talk about the extracurricular activities section of the engineering applicant portal. In this section, uh, this is your opportunity to provide us detailed information about your activities outside of the classroom. This information, along with your personal profile, which we'll discuss in a later video, is a very important part of our application as it's reviewed alongside your academic performance and is a key element of our broad-based admissions process. This information is also used to consider successful applicants for scholarship. You may select as many activities as you would like in this section. Uh, however, we are most interested in those activities that you've participated in within the last two years. You can also list achievements starting at the beginning of high school. We are not necessarily looking at uh, a long list of activities, but we encourage you to provide details so that the committee can understand the activity and what, how you are involved in your individual role. Uh, you are asked to indicate the level in which you were involved. Uh, for example, if you were involved in the high school chapter of a national or international activity, you should list high school. The national or international level should be reserved for students who have participated at the highest level of their organizations or have represented their nation. Your activities do not need to be related to engineering or STEM. U of T Engineering is made up of a diverse community of students who are involved in a range of different activities, from music and sports to robotics and community involvement. Uh, in this section, you may also include any full or part-time jobs you have held. The Reference Info section is where you will enter the name and contact information for somebody who can verify the information you have provided. Uh, the last area in this section is an opportunity for you to share with us how this opportunity and extracurricular activity uh, will co contribute to your overall participation and study at the University of Toronto Engineering Program. That was how to complete the extracurricular section of the Engineering Applicant Portal. Uh, our later videos will cover how to complete the remaining sections of the Engineering Applicant Portal. Best of luck on your applications.